hi welcome to my channel thank you for stopping by if today is your first time of watching my program you are highly welcome i give you a wonderful hug please if you have not yet subscribed i think that uh, red button that says subscribe beside that red button is a notification bell the essence of that bell is for you to be informed or notified each time i upload a new video so that you will go and check it out and my returning subscribers you guys are so wonderful i appreciate each and every one of you every day and my fellow content creator who wants us to be family there is no problem all you need to do is just to leave your comments down below i will visit your home through that comment and my viewers also who are not yet subscribed to my channel i beg of you please consider subscribing to be a full member of this great channel i promise you if you stay tuned you are going to learn a lot from my channel is it my news is it my talk show is it my evangelism is it my vlogs all those things are very very educative you i believe you are going to learn a lot if you stay tuned to my channel please consider subscribing so guys today i want to discuss about what is happening right now how people are using this uh, shutdown as an advantage over others especially in my country in nigeria could you believe how people can be so i don't know how to describe it it's not good most of the times we blame the government that they are not doing very well they are not doing what they are supposed to do believe you me for a country to be good every individual of that country have something to contribute it's not only the government the government have its own role to play and you as an individual as a citizen you have your own role to play in order to see to the affair of the country in order to see that everything works the law perfectly. is there the law is being made and this law was made by human being and also the law is also expected to be implemented by human beings now i heard in nigeria that you know all the country all over the world is shut down now including nigeria and do you know what people do they use this as an advantage over others especially those that sell uh, food food items what they are supposed to sell one naira they are selling it two naira five naira because of the shutdown this is not good we are blaming the government you as an individual what effort have you made what effort have you put in order to see that your country okay this is just a little event that happened everybody is facing it the whole world right now is facing it instead of us to help each others in the little way we can because the country is being shut down the goods you have you know how much you bought these good goods you increase them so that people cannot buy especially the poor ones i pity the poor ones i pity the poor people in nigeria right now the things that are being sell 2 naira 1 naira 50 kobo is not being increased times 2 why are we like this do we have conscience where is human conscience where is our conscience this is not good this is not good i promise yeah. you if you are the type of person that involve yourself in this in this art any money that you make during this period is going to do anything reasonable with it it's not going to be of any benefit for you anybody that is using this short advantage over others any money any profit that you make on it is not gonna be useful to you yes i say it i am going to repeat it hundred times it's not good we should help ourselves because you heard that everybody is shutting down, everything is being shut down. You have a bag of rice, you have oil, you have crayfish, you have fish. You know how much you bought these things. You know the normal price that you are supposed to, 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 to sell all these things. Because you heard that everything is being shut down, people will be in need of it. You increase it so that you can make more profit. 
The, the, don't you know that this is a cost money? Yes, because those people buying those things, they know how much they're supposed to buy it in a normal circumstances. You, and you increase it double to make your own profits. As they are giving you that money, buying that thing from you, they are crying. And that they are crying will not make you to do anything reasonable with that profit you are making. It's not good. Anyway, what do I expect from a lawless country? A country where everybody does what he or she wants. If it is an advanced country where the government fixes the price of the item, I will know where people will come and fix their own price. This is something you just maybe turn in your farm. You just, just go there and harvest it when you bring it. You know the normal price. As a human being with conscience, you should know how much to sell it. Oh, when you bring it, you say, ah, people will be hungry. If I sell this thing 2,000 now nah, or 20,000 now, nah, people will rush it now. Nah, this is opportunity to make money. And you are rejoicing. Yes, you are going to make the money, but you, you are not going to use that money to do anything reasonable because it's a cost money, it's a cheating money. Let us stop this. Let us stop this. We can help ourselves. Now that the government is being shot, people there, they are crying for electricity. They are crying for food. Uh, many people, if you go to the Instagram, they are sending account number, begging for food, begging for money to, to at least eat. And when they are being given this money, you will exploit it from them by increasing the prices of your product. This is not good. How much you bought those things and the normal price that you should sell it. Why not sell it and still make your gain? Instead of being greedy, this is greediness. It's not good. I don't know how, in fact, I don't know what is happening in the world today. People have lost their conscience. Nobody has a mind to help others. Nobody pity others. There are people there in Nigeria, they only go out. I said it in my previous video. They only eat from their hands to mouth, except when they go outside to hustle. They, they can eat. If they do not go outside a day, they can never find anything to do. And those people will go outside, make this money, or maybe eventually somebody dash them money that they can use, money they can last them for at least one or two weeks. And because of the increment in your, in your product or food items, those people may not find something to eat. The money will not even last for them. Is it good? It's not good. It's not good. Anyhow you look at this thing, it's not good. All these food items or this product before the shutting down of the government and you know the amount you bought it, you know the amount that you are supposed to sell it. Why not sell it and still make your gain? Instead of using it as an advantage over others because everything is being shut down. If this person come to my house now or come to my shop and ask me, do you have a crayfish? Do you have... I'm using all these things because this is the common thing people need now. Nobody is buying clothes, shoes or any other things. I am talking about uh, food items because as we are sitting at home now, this is what people need the most. So when the person comes to you, do you have fish or do you have oil? You say, yes, I have it. Uh, I want to buy one bottle. The person will ask you how much. Maybe the normal price of that oil is 100 naira then you will say it's 200 because you know that there is no there is no how the person cannot buy it because of how the word is it's not good you don't use a situation as an advantage because people are crying people are suffering and you want to use use it as an advantage over them if you are watching this video if you are listening to this video i want you to share it especially to those people in nigeria that is using this uh, short term as an advantage over others. Any profit uh, that they make in this is not going to be beneficiary to them. They are not going to use it to do anything good because it is a cost money. It is not good. And also, I also want to tell us as we are sitting at home, this period is not a period to eat. Yeah, you can eat. But this period needs us to pray to God because I can see that what is happening right now, 
the scientists, they cannot even do anything. They can't even help themselves right now, let alone helping others. It is only God that can help us in this predicament now. So as you are sitting at home, challenges you should be doing right now. Don't do running challenges, dancing challenges. You should be doing praying challenges. Pray to God. Let's call upon the name of God. Let's call upon him. Let him forgive us our sins and come to our rescue. I think this is what we need right now. It's not only to sit at home where you wake up, you brush your teeth, you eat food, you watch television or you sleep. No, you, all those things is also good. You can do it to entertain yourself. But at your leisure, call upon God. Let us all pray to God to forgive the world their sins because we have, we all, everybody, including me that is talking, we all have, we all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. So we need to plead for our sins so that he will deliver us from this situation and all of us will return back to our normal life. But for those who are using it as advantage, please stop it. If you don't stop it, if you continue, the anger of God will be upon you. But I just pray that let God not be angry with you, but you need to stop it. Sell your goods, sell it the normal price and let others benefit in this critical moment. Okay, do this and remain blessed. Thank you so much for stopping by or for listening to what I'm saying. Please, I want you to share this video. Leave your comments down below, whatever you think about this video. Write your comment down below in the comment section so that I will know what you think. And if you have not yet subscribed, as I said earlier, please do subscribe to be a part of this great channel. I also do live stream, like I said earlier. And my name remains Linda Dochuku Chukwezi. Keep checking the game, that's a natural.